Right, and we, we, we were trying to get onto the left, wasn't we? Yes. Sorry. All the in the jungle race. They're no living here forever. They'll live a long life. All the end of the jungle race. They go get permission with the boss of this place. Who's the boss? You don't even know that. Oh man. Oh man. Dude. I really want to talk to you. You look like a particular person that I need to speak to. <laughs> look, I found a fight! Yay, it's the smiley happy people! Look at all that money! More respects again? You sure are formal. Go ahead. Mr. Coates, the only way to get back up there is to win the chocobo race. But it's not as easy as you rookies think. Of course, if you got the boss's permission, it'll be a different story. But you'll never get that. <laughs> How do I get the boss's permission? I want the boss's permission. Can, can I get out of the cupboard at least? Thank you. Woo! He got to level up. Um, speaking of level ups, let's change, so... Just in the hope that the flamethrower device will work with the orb. Might not. Look at that. It doesn't want to change it back. You're just casually hanging around in here. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Let's go say hi to this building down here. Oh, look, a fight! I got my soft back! Woo! Uh, okay, that's fine. Hey, a bar! Okay, can, I, can I talk to you guys? A rookie! Then you gotta buy something, yep, that's a little here! Uh, we could have a couple of Phoenix Downs, we're kind of short. Thanks! I want to talk to the random guy that keeps walking back and forth. Yo, dude! Let me talk to your dude! No. Okay, where do I find this boss? Only reason why I like those bad guys. Dude, that elevator will take you to the top, but you gotta be picked as a chocobo racer first. How'd I get picked as a chocobo racer? This place is heaven. Man with a gun in his arm. <laughs> bad guys only tell lies, just lies. Exactly. I'll tell you one thing, Rocky, this desert is extremely dangerous. They have to welcome you in, but when you leave, try to leave, you'll swallow you. I hear some of them never make it out. The best thing is to stay out of the desert entirely. I'd love to stay out of the desert. But I want to get on the lift! Grenade bomb has been gained. Yay! Let's go talk to this guy again. I can get to the gate. Hi, random guy. Man, the boss was really in a bad mood today, or was he in one of his better days? Yes, yes. Come across some random cars. I just wasn't doing this in that one. I received my 340 gil. <laughs> I wonder 
to quit. <laughs> so my ease is gone. Is that you? No, oh, that's the voice I haven't heard in years. No, that's the voice I haven't heard in years. The voice I'll never forget. I always hoped I'd be able to see you again someday. I knew you were alive somewhere. We had the same operation. Listen to you, now you have to. I can hear her voice. What's that? Uh, it's Alona's voice, begging me not to hate your rotten guts. That's why I never hunted you down. I know it's stupid. I'm not asking you to forgive me. But what are you doing in a place like this? Why do you want to kill people who ain't even vault? Why? Why the hell do you care? You think the dead don't stop wise and hearing Shinra's excuses gonna make people in Coral understand anything? I don't care about reasons. All they give us are totally and stupid excuses. What's left in the world of despair and emptiness? <sighs> you still wanna hear why? Alright, I'll tell you. Cause I want to destroy everything. The people in this city. Blim, blim, blim. The city itself. The whole world. I got nothing left in this world. Carl, Eleanor, Marlene. Damn, Marlene! Marlene's still alive! Hmm? I went back into the town. I thought she was gone for sure. I wandered around town for a while. That's when I found her. Found Marlene. Hmm. She's in Midgar. Let's go see her together, alright? So, she's still alive. Alright, Barrett, then I guess you and me go fight. What? Well, it's all by herself. I gotta take Marlene to her. Dude, are you crazy? <laughs> Marlene wants us to see her mom, don't she? Stop, Dean! I don't die yet! Oh, yeah? Well, my life's been over ever since then. Stop it! I don't wanna fight you! You stay the hell out of this! It's my problem! able to do more damage than me. Well, I'm dead. <laughs> Should we try that again? At worst. <laughs> Hello, while well, we have to ask. Ah, 
How is my brother? He looks nothing like me. Powers. Here we go again. I think every two attacks he does, I'm going to have. I think that's going to be the best way of doing it. Matra magic. Okay, that doesn't really do a lot. That's fine. Uh, kill me! Thank you! <clears throat> Marvelous! Smine! Molotov cocktail. Knew we should have done a health. <laughs> You're gonna kill me off now. Molotov cocktail. I did just lose that arm like that. I lost something irreplaceable. I don't know where it went wrong. Hey! I don't know either, man. Is this the only way we can resolve this? I told you, I want to destroy everything. Everything. This crazy world. Even me. And what about Marlene? What's going to happen to her? Think about it, but I want Marlene back then. Even if I did go see her, she wouldn't even know me. And what's more, Boris, my hands are too strained to carry her anymore. Mm. Barrett. Get that pen to Marlene. It was Eleanor's, my wife's, a memento. All right. So Marlene's already full. Barrett, don't you, don't ever make her cry. Dane! 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 Me and you were the same! My hands ain't any cleaner. I shouldn't carry Marlene either. You want something? I want to go up. 
Like I told you before, you gotta get the boss's permission, then went to the with the cop talk about. Dane's got his reasons and cuss speak. So I got this instead. Yeah, but I wanna go up. Right. Did you kill Dave? You must have, or you'll never be holding that thing. So Dane's dead now. Maybe now this place will calm down a little. Dane didn't care about no one. The hell do you know? Right, right, I mean, no, I don't know anything, sorry! Then will you get us up there? Out of here! Huh? Oh man, you guys are mistaken! I already told you, there's only one way to get out of here! That's to win the chocolate ball race, and that's out of there in Golden Saucer! And the only race can come up on time! Say what? No, really, even if you threaten me! Our rules rule, I can't change it! If I do the whole system down, it'll get messed up by it, do that! Okay, okay, I'll let you go up there after uh, uh, deal with deal. Alright then. Claire, you go. We'll wait down here. Hurry up and win that chuggable race and get us out of here. Yes, good luck, <sighs> And you decided. All you need now is manager to register and get a chuggable. Hi, I happen to hear your story. Esther! <laughs> I'll be your manager! Well, I had nothing against it, but... This is Esther! She may look kinda of funny, but there's no better manager in the races! That's so rude! <laughs> yeah, well, nice to meet you, Cloud! Alright then, Cloud! I'll send you up the elevator, and I'll fill you in on details! Hmm, so that's what happened. I talked to Dio directly. You could just convince it in race. Oh yeah, getting back to the other thing. There are many different types of Jocko Jockeries. It's not only for criminals. Some people compete for the fame, some people for the money, some for glory. And then there are people like you. Oh yeah, I'll teach you how to ride a Jockeyball. Alright. Hmm, well first you use assist to choose either auto or manual. Then let you control the Jockeyball yourself or let you run on its own. But it's pretty hard to make the Chocobo run the way you want it to. If the Chocobo doesn't like you, it won't listen. Then, you're stuck. But most of the Chocobos I have are mellow, you should be able to handle them. When you're riding, you switch to speed up and cancel to slow down. But if you go faster than the Chocobo can handle, you will quickly lose the right and use OK to get a boost speed. But this makes your stamina run faster. Some Chocobos have bad temperatures and can't pace themselves. They'll lose their stamina quickly. These Chocobos should be set on manuals to slow them down. Finally, some advice for the wrestlers. Once the first and second Jocobo cross the Lyrical line, push the start and the race. Yeah! <laughs> you knew! Hi, Joe! Hey, Asta! You're lucky pretty as usual! Thanks! <laughs> Let me introduce you, Cloud! This is Joe, one of the top Jocobo jockeys. Nice to meet you, Cloud. If you're with Esther, then, uh... Right, he's an up-and-coming jockey. He's only been down there all day, and already he made it up here. What? Oh, I see. So why did you get put down? So we're not supposed to ask about the past here. Pretty interesting. I have a feeling that we'll meet again. <laughs> Then, until we meet again, Cloud! I'm going to check on the Chocobo. You just wait here for a while. Sounds good. I'm going to pick up this thing over here in the corner. It's a Ram War! I got nothing to say. The race will start in a few moments. When the Jockers for the next race, please proceed to the market. I repeat. Cat, 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 cat. I want to talk to you. Let me, let me talk to you. Let me talk to you! Rude. Guess I'll stay here then. Whoa! Rude. So, so you want me to walk up to you? Lazy. Thanks for waiting. I registered you in the next race. This is a chocobo I prepared myself. It should do well. So remember how to ride? 
but yeah. I'm good luck. <laughs> That was a tough break. Let me find a bit of chocolate for you. Wait here for a while, okay? Yeah, sure, yeah, sure. Hmm. The race will start in a few hours. Well, the workers for the next race will proceed to the park and repeat. Don't get cocky. Skills don't matter once you get to the race. Thanks for waiting, I registered in the next race. Let's just talk about prepare myself, it should do well. So remember how to ride? Yeah. So well, good luck! Super fast then. Congratulations, now you're home free. Oh yeah, the owner told me to give this dust to you if you won. Boy, if you're reading this letter, then you must have won. I know you earned it. I heard a different day from Easter. Now that you've won, I'm granting you and your friends a full pardon and setting you all free. And by the way, I have a party, I have a little gift for you to use on your journey. Sorry I couldn't be there to tell you this in person, but I'm a very busy man, so tell you. A gift? It's a phone call! Yes! Go! This is great! They said the manager stopped by and tried to have a buggy! Now we can go over dozens of rivers with no problem! Okay, Cloud, I'll be running right outside! Hmm, that letter continues. P.S. I recently met Seth Roth. I bet he's pretty popular with the boys your age. Uh, why don't you get his autograph? He was heading towards Gungaga, south of the river. Seth Roth. I guess this is a good boy. Yeah, well, if you ever get your own chocolate, we'll come back again. I'll take care of your registration and everything. I'll see you again. <laughs> Time to drive the buggy. Press OK to get on. Press cancel to get off. The buggy can go across shallow rivers and ditches. You can enter custom dump store and junior buy with the buggy by hitting a ride on the cargo ship. Let's we'll still get fights. How do we still get fights? Oh, Aris is dead. Well, Barrett is dead. <laughs> may have to, uh, escape. GAME OVER! <laughs> Guess where I last saved!
about when I find my buggy. Okay, we're back and I've got to save this time. Hey, look. That's it. So I believe up here is getting back to the uh, gold salsa. That's the one, yes. So if I die in a fight now, I'm not too bothered because I should just end up in the desert again. <laughs> not that I'm gonna die, but you never know. Look, it's a blown up reactor thing! Hi, dragon things. I believe these are quite strong. Game over. 